Holy shit, Bob. Hey guys, good morning, good morning. So today is Jessica's birthday, my best friend. She's also my neighbor. So right now we're walking over and it's the morning time. We're walking over, we're gonna go tag her car up and write happy birthday all over it. She turned 25 today, I'm so excited. So tonight we're gonna go to dinner with a few friends and then we're also gonna go roller skating for her birthday. So that should be interesting because I've never roller skated a day in my life. I roller bladed, but I've never roller skated. Have you roller skated? I did back in the 70s when it was popular. Really? Yeah. I never ever put a pair of roller skates on, only roller blades. So uh, we'll see. Should be interesting. Hopefully I don't like break anything. Um, but only our uh, egos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. So uh, we're about to go tag her car. Holy shit balls. So I just got in the car to go run some errands. That sky looks very dark over there. Uh, yeah, I wasn't expecting any like crazy storms or anything. Um, but so, okay. Right now I am on the way to Party City to go pick up balloons for my friend Jessica's birthday. It's her birthday tonight. We're gonna party. It's gonna be super fun. I'm so excited. This is really weird. Let me try to explain this to you. I do not like balloons. I don't know what it is. It's something about the noise that they make when they hit each other or when they hit other things. Damn, dude, what is up with this freaking sky right now? Do you see this? A really scary looking. Looks like a freaking something bad is about to happen. I do not like that. What the hell, dude? Creepy. Okay, so I'm. <laughs> So I have this like phobia thing with balloons. I really just don't like them. Jess knows this. So I think that she's gonna be kind of surprised that I'm actually going to buy her balloons for her birthday because those fucking things have to be in my car. <laughs> but she's such a good friend that it's worth it for her. I don't even care. Like, I think that she'll like, like she likes balloons. So, so I'm gonna do it for her because that's what friends do for each other. So I'm about to go pick up her some some balloons because we're gonna go to dinner and then we're gonna go to the roller rink after that so I want to have like balloons when she gets to dinner and like you know kind of like looks party-ish and like birthday fun and then I need to and then after I run to Party City I'm gonna go to Whole Foods because my mom's birthday is tomorrow and we are driving out to San Mateo for her birthday and I need to make her Rice Krispie treats and I'm going to make them vegan so that I can eat them and so can Trav. And she didn't want a birthday cake, she wanted Rice Krispie treats because she says they're healthier. So that's what she wants, that's what she gets. I've never made Rice Krispie treats before. She says they're really easy to make so I'm gonna do it. Hopefully I don't mess them up because right now I don't have time to mess them up. I'm like doing everything last minute because I've been so busy editing because I leave for LA the day after I get to San Mateo. Uh, because I have a bunch of doctor's appointments and it's my birthday and I wanted to spend my 30th birthday with my family I'm going out there for that and There's just been a lot going on. I needed to upload and edit videos why I was in LA it's Just been a little busy but getting shit done So I'm about to run into party city and I will see you when I got those balloons in my motherfucking car Okay, you guys so I got her this big-ass balloon back there and I thought I was gonna be able to like at least bring it to dinner, but I honestly like don't think I can do it It's I just I, it probably makes me sound so crazy, but there are certain things that drive me nuts like wind chimes um, Balloons anything that makes noise that I can't control or shut off like not like music, but uh, it's like a whole story time video. I'll just make another video on it But I am like so irritated that there's a fucking balloon in my car right now that I am just dropping it off at her house And I'm gonna say I'm so sorry. I love you. Happy birthday But can you just keep this balloon in your house because I was planning on having it at dinner with like all the birthday hats So it looks like festive, but Maybe I'm just a bad friend. I just can't do it you guys. I can't fucking drive the dinner is like 30 minutes away I can't drive the whole time with it there in my car 
I'm fucking crazy, you guys, but I want to try to be a good friend, so I'm going to drop this off at her house. All right, getting rid of this thing now. Mission accomplished. Drop off the balloon. <laughs> now I am heading back to the house. I have, like, not very much time to get ready for dinner, so I am going to get ready, and I will see you guys soon. Okay, look really scary. Just got home. I literally have, like, seven minutes to do my makeup. I just finished wrapping her gifts and filling out her card, and I'm going to finish my face, and then, uh... Hopefully, get out of here. I know we're going to be late. We're always late. So, yeah. Mostly, it's Travis's fault because he's the one that's taking forever. But right now, I might be the one that's holding us up. So, I'll see you guys soon. I got to finish my makeup. Okay, you guys. So, we are out to dinner now. We're here with Jess and her boy. I mean, not Jess. I'm sorry. Danielle and her boys and JD. And Trav. But most importantly, the motherfucking birthday girl. <laughs> Is that, is that the coolest so, yeah, thing well, ever? Look at her little outfit. Yeah, it's like been another whirlwind. Yeah. It's another day. It's all really good yeah, stuff. Yeah, Thank you for the shirt surrounded by nuts. Well, we're we're yeah, been, like, perfect. That's a great doing shirt for today. Late, late nights, trying to. Are you excited for your B day? Yes, turning 25. Oh, yeah, very excited. Thank you for coming. I really appreciate it. It's very fun. Princess. Yes. And you look gorgeous. Oh, you look gorgeous. Thank you. You look so festive and fun. I love that. I don't know why I keep putting this in my mouth. It's just like something like... <laughs> Alright, so we're going to order... Ooh, that looks good. Yum. So we're going to eat some food and then we're going to go roller skating. It looks like something out of 70s. What's up, bitches? <laughs> What's up? Are you scared that people are gonna crash into you? Yes! These little kids are dangerous! Oh, give them high five! Do I like sweat? Oh! Where did everybody go? They left me! They left you. Look at Brian! There's like a grandma out here with all these like young kids. Literally the oldest guy here. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, it would. That'd be really funny. I gotta break I gotta break my ass bone. I don't think they realize like I'm an amateur out here. Stop falling on front of people and on top of people. <laughs> We're going slower than everybody right now is the problem.
Or if you guys have another very happy birthday announcement, why not say Jessica to your 25? Happy birthday, Jessica! From all of your family and friends here at Sunrise, and this song is going out by very special request. So we are back from Jess's birthday. We had so much fun. Like seriously, that was so much fun. We felt we were the only adults skating. Like the only ones out there like we're so old. <laughs> it was like kind of a, not embarrassing, but it was just like funny that we were like the oldest ones out there. So when I was younger, I would go to the roller skating rink all the time with my friends. Like that was like the cool thing to do, you know? So it was just kind of cool to be back there and like have fun. And I think Jess had a really good time and that makes me happy because Jessica, like for those of you guys that don't know her, she's a caregiver and she's constantly taking care of people and she's just such a good person i call her mother Teresa. it's like an inside joke because she she literally is like mother Teresa to me and she does so much for other people she deserves someone to take care of her once in a while and so i really wanted to give her a special birthday for her 25th birthday so i think she really had a good time and that made me really happy and i know brayden did too and danielle and jd and her boys and trav and i really all just had an amazing time so it was awesome but I feel gross from being like at the roller skating rink, so I'm going to jump in the shower.